Let's give you a, a little lesson on what you could see on your screen. And you get a lot of information there. Uh, he looks like he's really accelerating, by the way. But there we have, you could see on the, on the right-hand side, the bottom right-hand side of your screen, it says the 405. He's heading 405. He just passed Venice Boulevard, almost about to exit. Then he hopped back on. So if you're familiar with that area, that's where he is, by Venice Boulevard, southbound 405. It looks like Culver. Uh, Culver City right now, so you can see that's where he is. On the right-hand side, you see a compass. That blue is the helicopter in the direction it's flying, so it's going southbound right now, and the orange you see, that's the direction of the camera. So that it's shooting just off the right-hand side, the front right of the helicopter, and there in the green, in the middle of your screen, that is the speed. Sometimes it'll jump. You saw it go to 120. Right no, there. That's yeah. probably not accurate. Uh, it's still trying to gauge speed its speed with the speed of the helicopter, so you'll see these huge jumps that it'll drop back. 90 miles, 93, 95, that's, that's pretty, pretty accurate right there. So he's probably pushing closer to 100 miles an hour as he goes on the shoulder of the road. Extremely dangerous because a lot of folks don't really watch the shoulder of the road right. when they're driving. So this guy is really moving. And, uh, you know, now this uh, driver is approaching the Marina Del Rey freeway, freeway. And if you're uh, familiar, he just decided not to take that. Well, it looks like he may end up taking it. This That one freeway is usually pretty empty um, heading out to the beach and Culver City. But he's not taking it. Now he's on the 90 freeway. So he, he took a pretty extreme left right there. Instead of going right, he had, all, you know, you can see that it's a maze of freeways. So he's on the 90 freeway. Um, and he's heading eastbound. And again, Culver City, it's saying Ladera Heights, but uh, this this is going to start changing a lot in a moment because um, he switched quite rapidly. Yeah, you could see generally where he's going, what he's coming up. So Ladera Heights, it looks like he's just gotten, he's going through Ladera Heights right now on the eastbound 90 freeway. He's near the uh, Slauson Avenue exit, uh, and then they're now heading eastbound. We, we saw them move southbound to eastbound now. He's on surface street, so this is where it could get exceptionally dangerous because depending on how he's going to handle this situation, in the past when we've seen people that are this reckless, they often go on the wrong side of the road, they'll fly through red lights, uh, fly through stop signs, and this is where often pedestrians can get hit and uh, oncoming traffic. He could uh, get into situations like that where he runs into somebody who just has no reaction time. Absolutely. So, Colleen, we have to watch this closely because of his aggressive driving continues on these surface streets. That's when it, it, it can be and, dangerous. And it gets so dangerous when you see pedestrians right there, too. It looks like he's going into sort okay, of a mall is. shopping center right he's, there. He looks like he's in a, a mall, yeah, uh, at Hannum Avenue in Ladera Heights. So we'll try to figure out what mall that is. But, okay, oh, he's wow. gone into the parking garage. We've seen this before too. So this is going to be really tricky for folks at the Fox Hills Mall. I think that's where we are, right? The Fox Hills Mall, Westfield, Westfield. Culver City. I'm